At number 10, Kylie Jenner. We can't have a plastic surgery video without talking about Icar Jenner. Apart from her sister Kim, Kylie is the next one you would think of when it comes to plastic surgery. Everyone knows Kylie for her signature big lips, but for a long time she denied ever getting work done. She built her entire makeup empire, Kylie Cosmetics, on her big lip brand because she claimed that for years she achieved her signature look by overlining her lips and therefore the Kylie lip kits were born. Turns out though that this was all a lie, probably just to boost sales. Kylie famously lied about how she somehow achieved a new appearance overnight, claiming that her makeup skills were the reason, but in reality, it's all fillers. Kylie finally came clean about her plastic surgery journey in an episode of Keeping Up with the Kardashians, where she said, quote, I was 15 and I was insecure about my lips. I would overline my lips with lip liner just to create an illusion of bigger lips. And then finally, I was like, this lip liner isn't doing it. I ended up getting my lips done. She kept up her fillers until her daughter Stormy was born, where at that point, she claimed to have gotten her filler dissolved, saying that she wanted to embrace a more natural look, but but this didn't last for too long as fans noticed her lip filler made a return a short time later. Now before I carry on with the list, I'd like to ask you guys to consider leaving a like on this video if you're enjoying it so far and also an exciting announcement, Lindsay Ivan is launching her own reaction channel Peach at the end of May, so go subscribe and tell her that we sent you. At number 9, Corinne Olympios. Like I said in my intro, celebrities are well known for getting plastic surgery here and there, so finding out that someone in Hollywood has gotten some work done really isn't all that surprising anymore. When fans ask about procedures you've had done, there's no reason to lie since these kinds of procedures aren't really all that taboo anymore. Turns out though that there are still some celebrities who want to make their fans believe that they are still au naturel even when that isn't necessarily the case. This happened with former Bachelor star Corinne Olympios after fans accused her of getting fillers when she said that she hadn't. In an attempt to try and disprove these fans' theories, Corinne posted some no makeup selfies but fans still weren't fooled and they went digging. The people over at Us Weekly thought that this could be a scoop and so they also went looking for some old pics of the reality star and voila, they found some. Images from Corinne's high school yearbook were published and it showed her looking pretty different than she does now, proving that she really was lying about getting fillers. People also realized later that her no makeup selfies didn't really do much to prove whether or not that she had gotten work done, so it was really just a handful of lies on Corinne's part. At number 8, Lady Gaga. Even though she sings about being born this way, that doesn't seem to be entirely true. Lady Gaga doesn't seem like the type to lie about her appearance, as she's been known to be a relatively open person, but it seems like her plastic surgery journey is something that she will lie about and clearly she's been caught. In an interview with Harper's Bazaar, Gaga once claimed that she had never received any type of plastic surgery procedure, saying quote, I've never had any plastic surgery, and there are many pop stars who have. I think that promoting insecurity in the form of plastic surgery is infinitely more harmful than an artistic expression related to body modification. But it looks like her claim of being all natural was a lie. During an interview with Howard Stern, she accidentally revealed her affinity for injections and revealed that she had in fact gotten some work done as she was once obsessed with getting facial injections. Though she may have resolved her obsession with Botox, she can't truly say that she's never gotten plastic surgery. Botox still counts, Gaga, but you still look fabulous regardless. At number 7, Sahar Tabar. Internet celebrity Sahar Tabar blew up on social media after she began posting pictures of herself with a dramatic look. She claimed that she had received 50 surgeries to achieve her drastic zombified look, claiming that the goal was to look like Angelina Jolie. A lot of people believed her story and took pity on her for having a botched look, but after shocking the internet, Sahar came clean about everything. Turns out everything was a lie. The zombie Angelina look, the story of how she got to look this way, and even her name turned out to be all one huge lie. Sahar's real name turned out to be Fatima Kishvand, and no, she hadn't really gotten 50 surgeries either. Instead, it was revealed that her entire corpse bride look came entirely from Dr. Photoshop. She came clean to her followers after posting a side-by-side -side comparison to her Instagram, showing how she really looks. She had been living this lie on the internet for quite some time, and because she had fooled so many people, and because her looks were so disturbing, she actually ended up getting in serious trouble with her government, and was actually sent to jail because of it. Even though this was all a lie, the consequences were severe and this served as a lesson to never tell a lie about your appearance. At number 6, 
Ashley Simpson. The 2000s were a seriously rough time for Ashley Simpson. First, she made major headlines after her cringy SNL lip sync fail, but to make things worse for her in the media, Ashley faced another scandal later on in 2006, this time for her appearance. In July of that year, Ashley appeared on the cover of Mary Claire magazine, where she was quoted saying that people should love their appearances and appreciate their bodies as they are. She essentially denounced getting plastic surgery and other alterations because natural is beautiful. But even after all that talk of being natural, Ashley went and got a nose job just shortly after the magazine hit newsstands. She was seen as a hypocrite and the magazine's editors received thousands of angry letters as a result. People were disappointed that Ashley would make those kinds of comments while having gone under the knife herself. She pretty much just tried to shrug the whole thing off and waited for the whole scandal to blow over, continuing to deny having gotten the procedure done, but then her dad spilled the beans confirming that she had in fact gotten a nose job. At number five, Rose McGowan. Actress Rose McGowan is a pretty open person, so no one would expect her to lie about something as menial as plastic surgery, but surprise, surprise, it happened. Rose is comfortable bearing it all on the red carpet and opening up about her struggles in her memoir, but when it comes to her cosmetic procedures, that's where the lies come in. In the late 2000s, Rose was seen in public looking pretty different, and immediately the plastic surgery speculation began. When confronted about these rumors, Rose told the public that she had to get reconstructive surgery due to injuries that she had suffered in an accident, but later in her memoir Brave, she revealed that this was all a cover-up. Rose said that her publicist told her to make up this story for the public to make it seem like her new face was because of the accident, but in reality, she had gotten surgery to fix a mistake a doctor had made when she had undergone a procedure for her sinuses. It was still a corrective procedure, but for a completely different reason than the one that she initially gave. At number four, Barry Manilow. One celebrity who has continuously denied their plastic surgery is singer Barry Manilow. For years, there has been speculation that he's gone under the knife on a few occasions, but Barry insists that he's never gotten any work done. In an interview, Barry claimed to have only undergone surgeries and treatments for his health, getting hip surgery, and receiving steroid shots, but a lot of people aren't really buying that and have pretty much revealed that he's been lying. It's been reported over the years that Barry has received a facelift in 1995, a second facelift in eyelid surgery in 2003, and then a third facelift in 2005. There are even photos of Barry from 2003 showing him leaving the plastic surgeon's office in Beverly Hills. In the photos, he's pictured with his face wrapped up in bandages while wearing a disguise of sunglasses and a blonde wig to avoid getting recognized. Even though Barry continues to deny his procedures, even a celebrity plastic surgeon can't be fooled, with Dr. Tony Yoon saying that he thinks Barry has undergone too many procedures. But what do you guys think? Is Barry lying or telling the truth about his appearance. At number three, Tyra Banks. For a long time, model Tyra Banks has been preaching about being all natural and about loving yourself for who you are. In the last few seasons of her show, America's Next Top Model, she even made a point of proving to the modeling industry that everyone is beautiful by casting models of all shapes, sizes, and backgrounds, but now it's looking like this was all just hot air as she's been caught lying about getting work done. Tyra once claimed that she was, quote, totally against plastic surgery, even going so far as to hire a doctor to come on her talk show to perform a breast exam in front of her live studio audience to show that she had never gotten work done like people had claimed, but it seems as though maybe that doctor should have paid more attention to her face because even though she's claimed to have never gone under the knife, it turns out that she's actually received a nose job. Tyra finally came clean about her procedure in her memoir, Perfect is Boring, where she wrote, quote, natural beauty is unfair. I really get uncomfortable when women who are these natural beauties judge anybody who's done anything to themselves. I admit it. Fake hair and I did my nose. I feel like I have a responsibility to tell the truth. At number two, Nene Leakes. With a lot of the celebrities I've mentioned in this video, they've been denying having had plastic surgery, and then the truth was later revealed. But with reality star Nene Leakes, her story is the complete opposite. Nene has always been very vocal about the work that she's had done. From getting liposuction, a nose job, and breast augmentation surgery, she wasn't really hiding anything. But all of a sudden, her honesty about her past procedures completely went out the window. In 2013, she went on the Wendy Williams show and talked about how she was all for getting work done and spoke 
spoke about how she was thinking of getting Botox in the future. Well, fast forward two years to 2013, and Nini sat down for another interview, this time with Bethany Frankel, and straight up denied ever having had plastic surgery. Everyone could tell that she had gotten some fillers, and no one can forget all those times that she talked about her other surgeries. So when she claimed to be all natural, saying, quote, why would I need plastic surgery? People were super confused and caught her in her lie. You can't take that kind of stuff back, Nini. And finally, at number one, Zac Efron. Now there's a lot of speculation with this one, so I'm gonna need you guys to sound off down in the comments and tell me whether or not you believe this. People are saying that Zac Efron has gotten some work done, and by some, I mean a lot. Zac recently showed up in a video about Earth Day looking a little different. The lower half of his face was looking super puffy, almost like he had gotten a lot of Botox done, and people are super confused. The internet was debating whether or not he had gotten plastic surgery, with some people chalking this all up to Zac simply getting wisdom and teeth surgery, using that to explain all the puffiness, but others aren't so sure. According to one celebrity plastic surgeon, it looks like Zach may have gotten fillers to reshape his jawline. It's all just speculation and theory, but a lot of people are hoping that it's just a nasty reaction to a bee sting or something, and that this puffy swollen phase of his is only a temporary look. Kicking off our countdown list number 10 is Cameron Diaz. The blonde beauty has been open about her Botox experience and said when she got it for the first time, she watched her in entire face change, which I thought kind of was the point. She has said that she quickly realized her face was never going to return to the way it was, and even after the Botox wore off, she knew that the anti-aging procedure just was not for her. She talked to Entertainment Tonight and said, I've tried Botox before where it was like a little tiny touch of something. It changed my face in such a weird way that I was like, no, I don't want to be like that. I'd rather see my face aging than a face that doesn't belong to me at all. Honestly, that last little line of her quote, I think that is the best advice I've heard when it comes to having cosmetic procedures done. Like, think about it. I would rather have my aging face than a face that doesn't look like mine. That's some good advice. Up next, number nine is Nicole Kidman. Believe it or not, the movie star has insecurities too, and similar to Diaz, she wanted to try the anti-aging procedures of Botox. Her face has always looked like a porcelain doll, even before the Botox, but she wasn't happy with it and wanted the change. But she didn't end up liking the change that it made to her face, and she said she could not move it. In 2013, she said, I did try Botox, unfortunately, but I got out of it, and now I can finally move my face again. The the actress has stopped getting the procedure done and said she tries to take care of her skin as naturally as possible now by wearing sunscreen, not smoking, and taking care of herself just overall in general. Cruising into number eight is Katie Price. The English model and TV personality has always had a changing look throughout the years, but she's been open about it and said she regrets some of the surgery decisions she's made when she was younger. She spoke about it with Daily Mail and said that she urges people to do their research before going under the knife because it was something that she did did not do. She said, I wish I had known that when I was younger because I could have saved myself a lot of heartache and surgery. But despite having regrets, she has continued doing more. And in 2019, articles surfaced everywhere saying her family is worried about her plastic surgery addiction. Her family and friends were practically begging her to stop after she started looking like a totally different person. Moving on to number seven, we have Khloe Kardashian. Coincidentally enough, her other sisters, Kylie and Courtney, were on the other parts to this list. Coincidence? I think not. So even though there is a ton of girls out there who look up to them and probably wish they looked like them, they actually regret some of the changes they've made to their bodies and face. One procedure that Chloe had done and regretted quickly was face fillers. She didn't like what it did to her face, so she went to try and have it reversed, but said that that process was a lot worse than the initial procedure. She spoke to MTV and said, face fillers didn't work for me. I looked crazy and I still think the effects are in there. I went to have it all dissolved like three times times, which we can imagine probably did more damage to her face than anything. Like having all that removed after. Up next, number six is Janice Dickinson. She has been given the titles of the world's first supermodel, but has gotten several procedures done to alter her natural beauty, which has left her looking like a completely different person. She's had a breast enlargement, a tummy tuck, facelifts, and liposuction. But the one procedure she regrets most is her breast implants. This regret came after she was diagnosed with stage one breast cancer back in 2016. The doctor actually told her that it's more challenging to detect abnormalities with 
within a breast when a woman has breast implants. So there is a chance that her cancer could have been detected sooner if she did not have them in. She talked about it and said, if I had to play my life over again, I would never have gotten breast implants in the first place. Happy with your list number five is Giselle Budshin. The Brazilian model and actress also had regrets with her breast implants. She admitted that after having two kids, she was unhappy with her breasts, so in 2015, she decided to get a boob job. But she later regretted that decision. When talking about it with People Magazine, she said, When I woke up, I was like, what have I done? I felt like I was living in a body I did not recognize. For the first year, I wore baggy clothes because I felt so uncomfortable. She also revealed that she first had them done because people kept commenting on the fact that they were uneven due to her breastfeeding. She said she felt vulnerable and had to change them because as a model, she was always praised for her body. Oh my god, imagine having that done and then feeling worse than you did before. And then for a year, you're like, that was pointless because I feel even worse. Oh, that hurts me. We've made it to number four and we have Kathy Griffin. The comedian is known for her wit and blunt personality, but her looks have always been a topic in conversation. Throughout her career, she has relied on plastic surgery and ongoing treatments, but there is one procedure that nearly killed her back in 2009. In her memoir, she published photos of her botched liposuction that left her looking like she described a CSI crime scene. She wanted to actually publish the photos as a public service announcement to try and warn other women who might be considering getting the surgery done. She was left botched after she suffered from some complications. She went four years without any plastic surgery after that, but then ended up changing her mindset about it and actually went on to have a facelift, a nose job, eyelid surgery, Botox, and more liposuction. That's crazy. After an experience like that, how do you ever go under the knife again? That's got to be traumatizing. The pictures are like... <clears throat> Taking over the third spot is Melissa Gilbert. The actress regretted her breast augmentation so much that she eventually had her implants removed. She opened up about it on her blog, explaining her big decision. Spending a lot of her life with a flat chest, she felt insecurities and decided to get a boob job after the birth of her first son and after her ex-husband had some negative things to say about her chest. That pisses me right off. So when she got divorced, she made a decision to get them done. But years after, she started feeling uncomfortable when doing normal activities and had concerns for her health. She said that she would take a Zumba class and fear that she would end up with two black eyes again, so she had the implants removed and regretted ever getting them done in the first place. Man, screw her ex-husband. In the number two spot is Jessica Simpson. She revealed a lot about her personal life in January 2020 when she released her memoir titled Open Book. She opened up about her experience with plastic surgery and some of the regrets that she had. In 2015, she had two tummy tuck surgeries, which left her with some complications after the second procedure. She explained why she got it done and said, I wanted to get rid of the stretch marks and loose skin left sagging from my back to back pregnancies. I was so ashamed of my body at this point that I wouldn't let Eric see me without a t-shirt on, Eric being her husband. Turns out she got an infection from one of the surgeries and she was in the hospital for nine days. She was vomiting so much, the doctors thought she was going to burst something and told her that she might need a blood transfusion. She also said that she had regrets when she got lip fillers done and was happy when those faded out after just a few months. In the number one spot is Gwyneth Paltrow. There has always been speculation and rumors going around about the work that she allegedly had done to her face. But she does stand firm on the fact that she's never gone under the knife, technically, when it came to her face. So it's really whatever you believe. But besides that, she has admitted to having many cosmetic procedures done, and one she regrets the most is Botox. This seems to be a trend, that people aren't happy with Botox. Just saying. In 2013, she told Harper's Bazaar, I've tried everything. I would be scared to go under the knife, but you know, talk to me when I'm 50. Except I won't do Botox again because I looked crazy. I looked like Joan Rivers. Not very nice, but coincidentally enough, Joan was on one of my other parts to this list, and she also regrets her plastic surgery. <sighs> this is a very big trend. Maybe we should all just not get it done. At number 10, we have Bella Hadid. So fans have speculated for the longest time that Bella Hadid has had a nose job, lip fillers, and Botox done over the years. Up until recently, Bella has denied the claims by saying people think she's gotten all this surgery and that you can do a scan on her face and it would prove that she hasn't had any work done. The model has also noted that she was scared of putting fillers into her face and that she would never want to mess up her face. Recently, however, Bella has come clean about getting a nose job and wishes she never had the procedure done when she was 14 and that she should have just let herself grow into her nose. As for the other procedures people claim Bella has had, she 
still denies them even to this day. Hey Peaches, are you liking this video so far? If so, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. At number nine, we have Jennifer Lopez. JLo looks pretty much the same age as she did when she was 20 years old, and it's clear that this woman does not age. Over the years, people have speculated that the reason the star stays so young is because she has gotten Botox, fillers, and cosmetic surgery. Every time this is brought to light to Jennifer, she's always said that her face is 100% her face and that she's never had Botox or any other injectables or surgery done. She will even go to say that her secret is that she uses her skin line, JLo Beauty, and if you want nice skin, you should definitely give it a try. The star has also noted that another JLo Beauty secret is that you should try spending your time being more positive, kind, and uplifting to others instead of trying to bring them down. You know that saying that being unproblematic ages you well? Well, JLo definitely proves that saying. And number eight, we have Kim Kardashian. So reality TV star Kim Kardashian has been pestered by the media and fans for years for getting plastic surgery or Photoshop when she flaunts her flat tummy and curvy appearance. Kim has responded by saying that she has had Botox done. However, her lips, cheeks, nose, and lashes have pretty much always been natural. However, a US-based plastic surgeon, Dr. Daniel Barrett, has come out to say that he doesn't believe that the socialite has never had any procedures done, and he also believes that the star has spent up to $39,000 on procedures such as liposuction and fat transfer. Back in 2011, the star tried to deny the claims even more in an episode during Keeping Up With The Kardashians when she had x-rays done to prove and deny the accusations of her having a BBL. However, if you compare photos of Kim from now to 15 years ago, it's clear that the star has had some work done and she just needs to be honest about it. There's nothing wrong with having work done, however, lying and creating unrealistic goals to your younger fans just isn't it. At number seven, we have Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande has had her fair share of rumors that she's gone under the knife to enhance her appearance. People have claimed that the star has had breast lifts or enhancements done, as well as an eyebrow lift, nose job, lip fillers, a butt lift, and cheek and jaw altercations. Now, Ariana has denied the allegations and has gone to say that people have been comparing photos of her since she was 14 years old, all the way to now that she's 29 years old. I mean, we all change our looks as we grow older, so it's hard to say if she's actually ever gotten plastic surgery or not. So what do you think? Are Ariana's claims false or did she have procedures done? And let me know in the comments below. At number six, we have Kendall Jenner. It clearly runs in the family as Kendall Jenner has been the subject of plastic surgery rumors over the years, much like her other sisters. Fans have claimed that the star has had a nose job, lip fillers, breast enhancements. However, compared to her sisters, it is clear that the procedures that she had had them done definitely were minor and look more natural. Kendall has said that as a model, why would she ever get procedures done to her face? And while it may look like everybody is out to see the star lose, her younger sister Kylie did come out to save her one time by saying that she did overline Kendall's lips one day. And it was funny to see everyone accuse the star of getting lip fillers done. As for the rest of Kendall's body, she did admit that her sisters are clearly much curvier than her. And growing up, she always compared herself to them a lot. Recently, fans have also accused Kendall of going under the knife for a bigger butt, but we're just gonna have to let Kendall address these speculations before we assume any more. At number five, we have John Travolta. Now, John Travolta has denied having plastic surgery done, and people have noticed that his changing appearance from the 70s heartthrob looks in the movie Grease all the way to now. With a looking like the star has had some Botox, eyebrow alterations, and hairline work done, the overall changes throughout his face can clearly declare that there were many actions taken to change the overall look from natural to artificial. John has definitely fought hard to lose his age and he's definitely tried to keep up with the glamour he once had before. Now, John has been pretty quiet when it comes to the surgery and I don't think we'll see him responding to the speculation anytime soon. However, it is his face and hair and many of us didn't expect him to do a surgery like this ever. At number four, we have Mandy Moore. Mandy Moore was accused of having a nose job done and it made fans speculate that the rumors were true and then she decided to laugh it off. When the rumors first started to swirl around the media, Mandy was quick to shut them down. And she even came out to say, people think that everyone in Hollywood has had a nose job or other work done, but it's not always true. People are going to believe what they want, that's fine. And while it may be true that a lot of celebrities are accused of having work, the rumors are true nine times out of 10, and Mandy may be part or may not be part of the 1%, but who knows? So with Mandy maybe having work done, 
one or maybe not. She has noted that she does not judge those who turn to plastic surgery or cosmetic surgery in a bid to improve their appearance. However, she's never had the work done and chooses to love her imperfections. And number three, we have Blake Lively. I think we can all admit that Blake Lively is stunning. However, did you know that people have accused the star of getting a couple of alterations done? Blake has been accused of having a nose job and eyelid surgery. If you take a look at some photos of before and after, you can see that her nose was quite larger and her eyelids were more down and hooded. Now the Gossip Girl actor has refused to confirm or deny getting the procedures done, so it only added to more heat to the rumors. It's clear that people love to speculate about celebrities' plastic surgeries, but when one stays quiet, it sure does send the internet into a frenzy. So Blake, did you have the procedures done or not? We just want to know. And at number two, we have Zac Efron. When Zac Efron appeared on a clip in promotion for Bill Nye's Earth Day musical, people were quick to notice that he had a whole new face. With his jawline looking fuller, people speculated that the star had worked done to his jaw, cheeks, as well as fillers and facial implants. Now, Zach would later come out to say that he never had any plastic surgery done, and back in 2013, he actually broke his jaw when he slipped and hit a corner of his face off a granite fountain in his house. The fall would force him to have his jaw wired, and it would cause his face to change significantly. Zach's change would remind us that sometimes changes reflect on a person's health mentally or physically, and we shouldn't be so quick to judge. And at number one today, we have Katy Perry. So it's not uncommon for celebrities to be hounded by plastic surgery rumors, and Katy Perry happens to be a celebrity who is constantly denying that she's ever had work done. Now the star has admitted to getting non-invasive treatments such as laser and lip injections to improve the dark circles under her eyes. However, people have speculated that the star has had a nose job, which she's denied. The star has also expressed that people shouldn't feel bad about getting any procedures done, and that as a society, we need to get away from the negative stigma about physical alterations. And the star has also said if someone wants a nose job to make them feel better, go ahead. Do what makes you feel better about yourself. At number 10, we have American actress Renee Zellweger. The rumors of her alleged plastic surgery operations started from her attendance at Elle's Women in Hollywood party in 2014, where the entire internet decided she looked completely different from her last public appearance. And trust me when I say they were not quiet about this. Aside from her not seeming like her usual self visually, Renee spoke with people about the issues following the social media rampant. She told the media outlet at the time, quote, I'm glad folks think I look different. I'm living a different, happy, more fulfilling life, and I'm thrilled that perhaps it shows. In line with her previous statement, she also touched on the fact that she felt like the conversations stimulated around her appearance in general were targeted at her by people who were snooping for an unrealistic truth, and how they wouldn't stop hassling her until she finally addressed it. Yet people were still far from convinced anyway, so I guess there went her hopes for less harassment. At number 9 we have California girl singer, songwriter, actress and TV personality Katy Perry. This pop princess has certainly made her mark in Hollywood over the years, but one thing she says she has not done is undergone plastic surgery. Perry dished to Refinery29 in a January 2018 interview about which cosmetic procedures she apparently made the decision to greenlight versus the ones she had not. In typical girl boss Katy fashion, she also proceeded to flock to the defense of people who obtain plastic surgeries, as she understands that doing so is both a decision and write completely for themselves. The Dark Horse artist detailed, quote, I haven't had any. I've done lasers and gotten injections under my eyes for the hollowing, which I'd recommend for everyone who wants a solution for their dark circles. But all my assets are real. People tend to think they are fake, but it doesn't really matter. We're getting away from the negative stigma about physical alterations. Of course, always be your authentic self, but if someone wants a nose job that makes them feel better and they love their profile more because of it, go ahead. Do whatever makes you feel better about yourself. At number 8 we have Emily Ratajkowski. Emily had accusations of getting lip injections before and she took to her Instagram stories to address the topic in January 2021. In this she fired back with, for anyone saying you need to stop with the lip injections, I've never had lip injections. No judging folks who do, but you can't get injections when you're pregnant. She even pulled out the statistics to back up her facts, following up with, a woman's blood volume increases 50%, which is why ladies can get a little puffy in the face and lips during pregnancy. In response, 
offense had said things like how Emily had been pregnant forever, which was a rude comment she very quickly shut down. She even later shared a picture of herself from the sixth grade to prove her natural lips are nearly identical, keeping in mind that as we develop, our facial structures can change slightly, so they wouldn't be 100% the same. Still, quite the impressive way to prove your point, Em. At number seven, we have American actress and model Megan Fox. Now, Megan had to respond to her own set of plastic surgery rumors in the windmill back in 2011, where she clapped back with a quirky Facebook album under the title, Things You Can't Do With Your Face When You Have Botox. And if this wasn't nearly comical enough in proving her haters wrong, Megan proceeded to create various facial expressions and at one point pointed to her wrinkles in the collection of photos. And well, when you're as stunning as Megan is, I can see why people would flock to the she's had plastic surgery for sure spiel. But regardless, please remember that not every beautiful celebrity has gone under the knife to achieve their attractive auras. Some beauty in Hollywood really is natural, and neither way is a wrong one of living. I know it's so easy to gossip about others' lives and what they choose to do with it, but we should really start refraining from commenting on people's appearances in general, even if we feel like some celebs are actually lying about it. Anyways, let's move on. At number six, we have the ever so iconic singer, actress, and dancer, Jennifer Lopez, known mostly under her stage name of JLo with how much popularity she's accumulated in her youthful looking years, it's no surprise that she's yet another celebrity who received plastic surgery accusations. In January of last year, JLo uploaded a video of her testing out her new face mask under her JLo beauty line. A user on the platform posted a comment which reads, you definitely have Botox, and tons of it. And it's all good, just saying. This seemed to be Jennifer's snapping point because she rapidly responded with LOL, that's just my face. For the 500 millionth time, I've never done any Botox or injectables or surgery, just saying. Get you some JLo beauty and feel beautiful in your own skin. Jennifer then added onto this comment with the statement, here's another JLo beauty secret. Try spending time being more positive, kind, and uplifting of others. Don't spend your time trying to bring others down. That will keep you youthful and beautiful too. Sending you love. What a classy way to stick it to them. At number 5 we have American model Kendall Jenner. Now the Kardashians have all been under loads of heat both in the past and presently about their supposed cosmetic procedures and lacks of truth in them. So of course Kendall was not safe from social media's firings. In a 2017 upload on her website and app, Kendall debunked cosmetic surgery theories from fans following a Facebook live event she and her sister Kylie collaborated on. Kendall explained how her younger sister's makeup skills were the reason why her appearance seemed altered. Fans were not convinced, but Kendall still wrote the following. Quote, All of a sudden, photos of us came out with headlines like, OMG, Kendall got her lips done and got full facial reconstruction. Look at her cheekbones, look at her nose. I was like, this is crazy. I didn't even address it at the time. Because if I address it, people are going to be like, oh, so she's defending herself. She must be guilty. As a model, why would I have my face reconstructed? It doesn't make any sense. Kylie had previously cracked a joke by accepting responsibility for the spark of rumors of Kendall's face when she did her older sister's makeup. She informed Snapchat that Kendall let me overline her lip today with lip liner and everyone thinks she got lip injections. I'm sorry Kendall. At number 4 we have another American model, this time it's Bella Hadid. Models seem to be a trend for centering around accusations of them lying about plastic surgery, but I believe it's because a supermodel's entire career is based on how she looks, and unfortunately that means speculations and criticism will always come at large against the praises. As an accomplished model in gigs, Bella also takes one of the top spots of being a style and beauty icon, so naturally she's been under fire for not being entirely natural. But Bella has denied these claims every time. She spoke with InStyle for an interview in 2018 where she stated, People think I got all this surgery or did this and that, and you know what? We can do a scan of my face, darling. I'm scared of putting fillers in my lip. I wouldn't want to mess up my face. At number 3 we have Hailey Bieber. Amongst her fairly recent title of being Justin Bieber's wife, she is very much her own person because of the mega successful supermodel career she maintains. Hailey has also faced previous backlash about possibly lying about getting procedures done, and many will say her before and after pictures speak for themselves. Her subjection to harsh criticism led to her slamming a plastic surgeon account on Instagram when a side by side photo of her as a teenager was being compared to her visuals now. Quote, stop using pics that are edited by makeup artists. 
This photo on the right is not what I look like. I've never touched my face, so if you're gonna sit around and compare me at 13 and then me at 23, at least use a natural photo that wasn't edited so crazy. I think I'll leave this one up to you guys to debunk though. At number two, we have another Kardashian. This time she is the core of their bunch and single-handedly the reason why they all have their fame today. Kim Kardashian has always been a touchy subject when it comes to plastic surgery theories for as long as I can remember. But one instance that really reeled everybody in was her body accusations after she gave birth to her eldest daughter Northwest back in 2013. Naturally, the reality star was absolutely livid about the fact that her post-baby efforts in the fitness department were suddenly being overshadowed by accusations of her having gone under the knife to achieve her bounce back body. She released a tweet which stated, I'm very frustrated today seeing reports that I got surgery to lose my baby weight. This is false. I worked so hard to train myself to eat right and healthy. I worked out so hard and this was such a challenge for me, but I did it. I'm so proud of my accomplishment and no one will take this away from me with fake reports. Say what you want about me, but I work hard and I'm the most disciplined person you will ever meet. As if she hadn't proven her point enough though, Kim spoke out once more a couple of months following a fan questioning on social media why it was so hard for everybody to believe she didn't work hard to achieve her body. They also complimented the reality star by saying how great she looked, to which Kim had responded with preach lol thank you. It sucks when people make up surgery or photoshop lies when I'm so disciplined and work so hard. Just trying to motivate others and show anyone struggling with weight they can totally achieve what they want if they're dedicated. I'll leave it at that. At number one, we have our affluent pop princess Ariana Grande. This wouldn't be the first time the gorgeous starlet would receive rumors of lying about procedures people believe she's undergone, but it would be the last time she used up her energy to address it. Ariana once pointed out in a 2014 video, quote, on the cover of some magazine, they said, oh, Ariana Grande, boob job, brow lift, cheap shaving, lips done. I was like, you're comparing a picture of me from when I'm 14 years old to when I'm 21, and I'm wearing a push-up bra. Ariana also readdressed the rumors while reminiscing at throwback family photos with her older brother Frankie. While doing so, she lightheartedly joked, that's why I'm on the cover and they're saying I got plastic surgery. Goddamn puberty went nice. It came late, but she finally came through for me.